here is the radio sound or sound and I don't know anything about it I just thought it was very interesting I uh, plan on studying more about this but this thing actually is goes on the balloon like this where that's pointing the cone is pointing down and I don't want to take this off this whole plastic thing has got to come off I've had this for a number of years but never did anything with it uh, got this little metal bar here on and off switch and I would suspect this is the battery compartment uh, looks to be in pretty rough shape but there are uh, some writing on this uh, I know you can't see it from there but I do have a close-up of this writing right here and it uh, says uh, Bendix Corporation made this and I've got some close-ups of this and I also enhanced the uh, saturation and so you can read it a little bit better and on the bottom here is about the same thing and of course I did an enlargement of this also so you could read it uh, Bendix Aviation has made this for the Signal Corps US Army this would be about 19 well in the 60s uh, probably late 60s uh, because of the components that are in here and like I said I don't want to take this off yet uh, it's in bad enough shape without uh, destroying it completely but maybe and this plastic here is amazing it's uh, really falling apart but what this does is uh, it goes balloon takes it up in the air and it reports back uh, uh, barometric pressure and uh, temperature and probably humidity and uh, this is you know, in pretty 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 rough shape I'm gonna see if I can't light some of uh, if I get this over here so it'll stay like that I'm gonna zoom in and see if I can't light up some of those components in there oops gotta push this back here there we go okay we've zoomed in I'm gonna bring in a light here and see if we can't see some of those components let's see if I can see what that is oh uh, that's a coil down there and a mica capacitor and some more capacitors and a resistor I can see can't see what the first color is but I can see red red and then 10 percent band and then the bottom of this interesting cone here okay and the writing is on this side okay I'm going to turn this around and see what we can see 
on the other side here. Sure, this is still in the picture. Yep. Okay. Uh, I can see a capacitor. And there's another coil. And there's a paper cap down here. And the bottom of this cone here. So, definitely 1960s, no question about it. So, there's one thing that I was looking at, since this thing is pretty much falling apart. Uh, I'm getting caught up here. Let me back the camera up a little bit here. Okay. I was looking at this earlier today, and it looks like these, you know, clips go up in here somewhere. And, but, well, I'm not sure where they go, really. They could, they could go up here. Don't think of it, they do reach. But, there's a, a clip right here. And maybe, if I bend this forward and straight, maybe this will pull open. Okay. I have no idea what we're going to find. Oops. I can't. Uh, that's interesting. They even have a relay in there. And there's a little gear that turns here. And, oh, this, this would be for the uh, barometric pressure. So, it looks like, and of course this would be for the battery, and I don't know if I want to mess around with taking it any farther apart right now. Okay, that, okay that's where the cone, this is where the cone plugs in. And there is a little bit more in here. And uh, let's see here. A little bit more light here. Uh, that's interesting. Looks like a Some kind of scale there. Don't know. This is. I'll have to. I'll take a still picture of this and put that in there. But uh, I don't know how you get to the battery department. Uh, what well or what I think is the battery department. I don't know for sure. But this has never been opened before. Let me put that back underneath here. There, we go. there is there is some more stuff there, but I don't I don't know if that's a battery or not. Uh, my guess is it might be because uh, it has done a number on that plastic. So. Well, I'll look into this a little bit more, but I thought you'd be interested in seeing an old 60s uh, uh, weather instrument 
and uh, that they'd sent up uh, with a balloon. Thanks for watching.